it's Catherine. Um, I am one half of the team, husband and wife team, of Your Little Castle, and I am here to bring you a beauty box um, that I subscribe to, uh, the Julep Box, uh, for the month of October. I think, yeah, that's the way it goes. You pay in the previous month, and then it's for October. I think so. So, um, here is my box. I've already opened it, so it'll be easier to get into. There you go. That's what she looks like. Mm -hmm. The coupon card. $10 off your next julep.com purchase of $25, which is quite nice. And that is good for the month of October. Then um, we have Dark and Stormy Nights is the name of the collection for this month. They produce small batches of polish in collections, um, so it's fun because they always have something new for what's called Julep Mavens. We are all stars and we deserve to twinkle. And the quotes by Marilyn Monroe. Uh, people with subscriptions. Um, and they have uh, the night shift on the inside explanation of what that is. It's actually one of my favorite masks um, for overnight because I have very joss two of them. Woo, hooray! There's a free gift inside this Maven box because you purchased three or more add-ons. So, <laughs> so inside the box, it also says, if you can put it on, you can pull it off. Hashtag brave pretty, part of their um, advertising campaign. Uh, very cute little campaign, very positive. Um, all of their products are five free. You can go to their website and learn more about what that means. Lately, I've been very concerned with saving money with my beauty and finding beauty that is helpful. I did get some extras. Okay. So, there is a very blackish purple polish. And you can't tell what the names are until you open them out of these packages. So I'm going to first show you what the box looked like with all the products in it. And then I'm going to pull out the uh, polishes one by one and show you. And try to keep them in order so I can then take them out of the little packages and tell you the names. So there's this one. It's very dark. I think that might be the one I got for free. I'm not quite sure. Oh, this is the top coat that they said would come in my box for free. Um, it's a holographic top coat. So I pulled that out. Now, ooh. Okay, I think this is one of the things I got for extra. And it was a trio of these um, shimmery, holographic-y kind of, um, ooh, I'm not very good at showing you guys stuff yet. Um, like that. Oh, that works kind of. So there's a blue tinted one, a green tinted one, and a purple tinted one. I actually currently have the more um, purple pink tinted one. I believe that this is one of the polishes that's part of this month's collection. It's a very dark red color. Ooh, yeah, and this is even darker. Look at that. Yeah, yeah. So we'll take them out and we'll have you guys take a look. Okay, um, here we have a uh, cleanup tool. Comes in a little box like this. Another holographic polish. I wonder if they just gave me two as my extra. I don't know. I don't know. I'll have to see. Okay, so quick dry top, uh, little toppers. So you put them on your nails and it's supposed to make your nail polish dry quicker. I'm skeptical, but I really wanted to start trying stuff like this. And since they're a brand that has 
less bad chemicals in it um, than other nail polish brands, I thought, hmm, this might be uh, something I'd be interested in trying. Well, usually they give you a little piece of candy, but so I'm thinking that they're not doing candy anymore. Last month was their anniversary month. Anyway, they give you this nice little packing stuff. I keep this stuff for Easter. That's one of my little hacks because I really don't want to pay for plastic grass that's just going to go live in the landfill forever. So and there's that. So I'm going to open these up, swatch them on their lids and on my hands and get their names and I will be right back. Honestly, I don't know what I'm doing with nails. I get people to help me usually because I can't see my hands to or my feet to paint. So what I do is I take and I drop not one, but two drops of the nail polish. And then right here it says, swatch me, swatch me. So I take my drops and I turn it upside down and I gently wiggle it back and forth and I pull it across the surface. Most of the time it goes on quite easily. wee bit glittery, but I don't know. Maybe it's this lighting. Can you guys see anything? What about you, Editing Catherine? Is there any glitter in there? No. So the one that looks pretty black is called Colton. Let's see if I can get it so you can see it. No, it won't focus. It's a black with like a purple. It's pretty much a black with a purple hue. Then we have our metallic uh, top coats. So it's um, a type of top coat that they have and I love it. So I was very excited when I saw that there were three for $11.99. So the one that has the green hue is called Bjork and it's uh, the it girl um, so there's several different kinds of styles that they um, style boxes after and it girl is one of them and then they have um, Tilda which is in bombshell and Tilda is oh okay this is the green one this other one is a blue green yeah blue green green one Tilda's the green one, Bjork is the um, blue one, and then my favorite one is the more pinky purple one. Um, and then this is um, for their boho glam girl. Um, it is more of a pink um, iridescent, and it is called Tyra. Um, so if you're more of the boho, this is supposed to fit you, but I think it doesn't matter what style you are, you can have all the colors. Um, then for this month, these are part of their, um, their October collection. So there's more of a red cream, um, which is like a oxblood type color. My swatch is kind of messed up, but um, it's called Jean, and I think it's supposed to be classic with a twist, is the kind of girl it's supposed to be for, which is more my style, but I will wear all the colors. And then there is one more cream and then the other one for October that I got from their collection which they have a lot more than two um, is Katya and it's a uh, classic with a twist I think and um, it's a it's a dark purple I don't really like purple 
So every time I get a purple, I get very um, disappointed. The description, I didn't understand that it meant purple. Um, it is a cream polish, um, just like the red I got. I prefer cream polishes over um, glitter polishes. Uh, cream polish does not mean color. It means that it is a, um, tr it's a transparent coat. It's not a jelly coat. It's not a glittery coat. Um, the very last polish that they gave me, um, I think was my bonus item, um, which is supposed to be a sparkly top coat that's supposed to be holographic, but I, I don't really, maybe it shows up in sunlight. So, and this one is called, uh, Desiree, um, and it's an it girl, um, is the style profile. So if you would like to get a discount on your first julep box, please check the down bar. Um, and hopefully by then I will have gotten a code uh, to put in there for you guys. Um, and if not, just keep checking back. I'm going to keep talking to julep to see if I can get you guys a discount. So that's it on the julep box, I suppose. <laughs> okay, I'd like to see what the items that are in boxes look like, and I bet you would too. So this is the Tada Drops, and they give you the dropper separately, so you're supposed to unscrew this and put this in, um, which I think is very clever. And it had a nice little divider in there too to keep everything all nice and neat. So it's a pretty good amount, I mean considering you only use like a drop per nail. Um, let's see if that works. We will try it. Um, then there is the Night Shift Mask, which again is my favorite overnight moisturizing mask. And in the box it looks like that. It comes out. It's a very handsome bottle. Oh, they changed it a little bit. Bottle now is shiny and it has a bit of a gold shimmer to it. And the um, cap isn't shiny anymore. It's uh, a matte silver. Wonder if the formulations changed at all. Oh no! It has a little little thing you have to peel off. But I can smell it through it, and it doesn't smell like it's changed uh, the fragrance at all. Hold on one second. I'll show you what the old one looks like because I am almost done with it. This is the new one, and this is the old one. So the text on it is a little bit bolder. Um, the old one, the text is in silver. Um, the filling of the package, this one has a little bit of a, like almost like a cloth kind of feel. I don't know how to explain it. It's like textured and this is very smooth. So they look very different. On the back of the products, this has a whole lot more text. I can't see any of it. And this is a whole lot less text. Um, but I can't see any of it. Um, and of course it tells you how long you can keep it around. I think that says 18. I don't really pay attention to those things, though I should. Um, which packaging do I like more? I think I kind of like the old packaging better. I think it looks classier. Um, I think putting color, this purple on the front, really turns me off. I think it makes it look cheaper. Also, the shine of the product, to me, makes it look cheaper. But I bet you guys would like to see, just like I would like to see, what the, um, ooh, okay, I opened it the wrong way. This is not the, yeah, okay, but that's all personal taste. So that's Night Shift, um, and if you'd like to see what it looks like, I'm always happy to put some on. So I am wearing makeup right now, so I don't really want to put too much of this on. I don't really have any makeup on my forehead, so I'll keep that on. So I need this so bad in the winter. It's ridiculous. So I'm really glad that I got another one because the amount that's left in here is only going to last me like maybe a month or two. Okay, so I got my little cleanup tool. And I mainly got this because I'm going to have to try to give myself pedicures even though I can't see my own toes because I'm trying to save money in the beauty arena with that. So you can see they have the 
packaging is very good. They've made it so it won't rattle around too much by putting a little divider in the box. Ooh, it has a very beautiful little coating on it and it's very petite. All things I like for my nail kit. So um, it looks like, yep, works really good underneath nails. Um, and it looks like it will be really nice for creating some nail divines too and pushing some stubborn cuticles um, down away from the nail. I really like this. It has a little, has little grips on it. Um, um, I will have a breakdown in the down bar of what I spent. Um, the monthly box is about $20 a month, um, but just to show you what you'd get, um, you would have got so you would have got three polishes and a beauty product. Um, I think that's pretty good um, for 20 bucks, being that um, a really decent nail polish at the drugstore can be like six dollars. Um, right there is twelve dollars, and then another six is eighteen dollars. So you pretty much have the cost of your box. And then you have a moisturizer that will last you over a year um, on top of that. Um, and this moisturizer is really more of a night mask, but you can use it as a moisturizer. I have used it during the day underneath makeup. Um, very, very light makeup because um, it makes you very shiny. Um, totally worth it. Non-toxic. Highly recommend it. Hopefully I will get a link for you guys soon. Um, that will be in the down bar for a discount um, that will benefit me too maybe because that's the whole thing if you get friends to join um, and get a box um, you get the benefit of I think a free box or money leading up to a free box I'm not really clear on how it works but it, it explains it all on the website so please see the down bar for a breakdown of the cost of this box I will have the membership listed and then all my extras um, like the ta-da drops and I hopefully in the future will let you know how I like them. Um, in the future on the blog I will be referencing this uh, video, the beginning of this video, um, because I will be doing a how to save money while still feeling pampered and gorgeous um, blog post and the whole idea of me getting uh, julep is to satisfy my love of beauty and to also get things that I generally need but um, it's supposed to replace going and getting uh, manicures right now and it has um, but I do find that the little gadgets you need do add up in cost the ta-da drops and um, top coats bottom coats sticky coats because I have really terrible nails <laughs> and um, it takes a lot to get nail polish to stick to them and if you uh, would like more unboxings I would be happy to do that I just need you to comment in the comments until next time uh, from our little castle to yours thanks for watching and please subscribe <laughs>